What's up everybody? It's time to do the seed start for 2022. Today is March 1st. And this is the day that I start the pepper and beet seeds and also the kohlrabi. On my layout, I have the number of seeds I need to sprout for the peppers. Got my seed packets ready. I have folded pieces of paper towel and I'm labeling some Ziploc bags. I clean the counter and wash my hands. This is a spray bottle with just regular water and I'll moisten the paper towel. These are giant Marconi pepper seeds. I'll fold the paper towel over, moisten it some more. Insert it into the Ziploc bag. Seal it up, but leave a little bit of air in there. So the paper towel is completely wet and this is about the right amount of water. You, just a tiny little bit that pools up in the corner is a good amount of moisture. These are the beets. It's okay to pick them up and arrange them as long as your fingers are clean. These are the kohlrabi seeds. They look like tiny little ball bearings. So the first batch is ready. It took about 10 minutes. This is an electric heat mat. It's connected to a thermostat set on about 80 degrees Fahrenheit. This little probe is what regulates the temperature I'll lay down one towel. I'll put half of the seed bags, put the temperature probe in between. Then I'll cover it with some more towels. And one more. These are like blanket insulation. And then I'll leave it here and they should germinate fairly quickly. I'm gonna prepare my seedling soil. I take one of my containers and dump it into a wheelbarrow. Then I mix in a little Fox Farm Light Warrior potting mix. This is really loose, airy stuff. It's really good for seedlings. And I'll also add a little bit of worm castings. This helps enrich the soil. Gives a little bit of fertilizer. Here are the beet and kohlrabi seeds after four days of germination. And the giant Marconi pepper seeds are just starting to sprout after four days. Something new I'm doing this year is I'm going to bottom water. I'm gonna fill the lower part of this container with water and then I'll wait a little while as the soil sponges up the water from below. Now that they're all moist I'll transfer them into a different tub so the water it doesn't pool and oversaturate the soil.
it's about 75 degrees and sunny and warm so I'll put it out here on the front steps as the Sun is setting turn on my 100 watt grow light and there's also a fan that circulates the air I lowered the light so it's about five or six inches above the top of the plants and in general I'll turn the lights on at 7 in the morning and I turn them off at 10 o'clock at night. This year I'm going to do these videos in little segments. In two days I'm going to start the tomato and basil and lettuce and kale seeds. So stay tuned.